social medias. There are many, many social medias. And I happen to be on a few of them. And if you want to check, them, check out which ones I'm on, there sh if you go to my channel, if you go to my channel, there should be at the banner, bottom corner, if you're on a computer, a bunch of links. Or you can go to the information tab or whatever the, what that tells you the bio thing I had to write on my channel um, tells you that and underneath there should be links to more stuff and to the same stuff that you get on the computer so this also applies to the phone as well and so but there's one social media that I find extremely helpful and that is Google Plus. Well, I did find it useful before the shutdown announcement. Um, oh, I'm just sort of lost, sorry. It's just scared by the horses. And if the words. Okay. Why I find it so helpful is. The fact that it does everything something with Facebook can do, or Twitter. The thing is, it doesn't take up as much room as um, those two because it's already on the phone. Well, for my phone, it is. A lot of phones, it would be a default app. Don't know if it is on the latest models, but this phone, Samsung Galaxy Core Prime, I know for a fact that it was a default app on this probably is for a lot of us, Samsung Android devices and that is a huge help for me because then the function that I look for is just being able to post randomly so not just images but videos and absolutely nothing like just text really and then you got yourself a nice app other, but on the sh now that they've announced the shutdown, it's kind of useless. And while I do have a Twitter, I basically no one pays attention to my Twitter account. Trust me, no one does. And if you're going to suddenly change that, well, thank you. I'm still not going to use Twitter as much. I use it not as often because I've actually uninstalled the app and I've um, bookmarked Twitter Lite, which is at just the Twitter website on mobile and just bookmarked it and added it to my home screen so uh, basically it's Twitter but really it's just Samsung internet browser um but I don't have Facebook which that would probably provide the same things but one I have no clue how to navigate Facebook I'm not going to do that either and two I'm not bothered to download it and make an account and I'm probably Facebook probably isn't a good social media for me I don't know Another function Google Plus has that other social medias don't is communities. Some do have this thing, but some don't. For example, Amino, that is all about communities though. So one of the downsides to that is that it's only communities. So if you want to post something to a large amount of people and not just to a specific community, you're going to have to join however many communities and paste, copy and paste the same post over and over and over again. Can get annoying, but Undertale, Amino in general also has a lot of formatting options. I don't use Amino anymore. I had an account, a lot of followers and stuff, and I got about 30 likes per post most of the time, but nothing really happened. Not, not much happens on it, and I don't really find a used to it. I'm sure I could find some amazing Undertale related stuff because I was in Undertale Amino but honestly it was kind of annoying if I wanted to keep getting those coins every day because what I kind of did so I could buy more stickers or just to donate to other people because that's what I like to do I'd have to go in every day every day every day every day and check in and I know it's not, it's not compulsory but I have I have felt like doing it and it got annoying, especially when I screwed up and the only way to replenish it is to spend your coins, which you're going in every day 
to earn those coins anyway. So there's no point in fixing the streak to earn those coins when I'm in to spend those coins. And you're earning the coins from checking in every day and doing a daily um, card thing. Um, I use Instagram as well. I used to use Snapchat, but the thing that those two have is that you have to have a photo or a story. Now, Snapchat is actually a bit worse to me. Um, you have to have a separate app to have a um, special avatar thingy, Bitmoji, which is kind of cute, but why can't there be a built-in editor just for people who don't want to download a separate app? Um, and another problem is that the fact that there's no general posting, it's either your story or to someone, a direct message. Instagram on the other hand has posts, stories, and DMs, which is pretty good. I, I like Instagram, right? It's probably one of the social medias I use the most, other than Discord, um, which if you, if you classify Discord as social media, which honestly I do, and I can tell you reasons, not yet. The thing that annoys me about both Instagram and Snapchat is that it's only photos and all videos. You can't just post a bunch of text. Unless in Instagram, you, you, there is a text option in the stories, which is still a photo, you have to view the photo. And with the tech um, posts, you can just grab a black photo, just nothing, and put it with text, but you have to just get that black picture, which for some people, I mean just downloading an image or taking a photo of absolute darkness with their camera against their hand. Um, this is annoying because then you have to actually get the photo and you can't just select black. Nothing. Or you can't, or you can simply just, can't just remove the image. Um, but Instagram, I'm fine with Instagram, I get that that's the point of it. It's okay, and same with Snapchat, I get it. But, I, this is why I like Google Plus, so I can have a regular social media. Um, Discord now. With Discord and Skype. I don't like Skype. It's not very... I just don't like it. It's a very annoying to me, and... Yeah. It's annoying. You probably know if you, if you use Skype and then switch to Discord, you'll find how much more you can do with Discord. And the best part is with Discord is... Well, multiple things. Not only is it just a, um, you can contact one person and individual people in a group as well, so individuals and a group, but whole community. You can join a surfer with a bunch of people you don't even know, talk to them, and they they won't don't even have to follow you. You can just talk to them. It's like just it's just a giant group chat. And the best part is you can sort each conversation into channels. So different people can have different conversations without it merged into one chat. Which is the problem I have with Skype, they don't have that. And Discord bots are actually useful. On servers you can get custom emojis. You can even have GIF emojis if you find if you have Discord Nitro, which I don't, so I don't have those. You, if you have Discord Nitro, you can use emojis from other servers into your on other servers. So your server emojis you can use on others, or vice versa. It's just anyway. And the best part is that Discord it actually has a lot of different things. Like that makes no sense right now, but what I mean. Like you can video call, voice call, you can eat, which is simple, like Skype mm -hmm. has it. You can also voice call and we'll do that together too. One um on a server, you just have like about 20 people at once all talking, or on a group chat, you can video call the group chat and just have everyone in a single video group. Thing. With the Avengers. And Discord also displays everything, anything you play if you have that option on. If you're streaming, and again, with Discord bots are actually useful. You can have 
Discord bot on a server that announces every single time you post a video, or every time you start a stream on Twitch, or it can just give you the news. You can even play fun games with bots, and I find this extremely, extremely useful. Discord is most used social media I have, and that's why I classify it as a social media, because it's got communities and all this extra stuff. It has what Skype has, and it has what other social medias might have, which kind of makes it a mixture of a social media and a chat. And the best part is, you could customize notifications to your own way. Now that they've got, now they've got an option to suppress mentioning everyone, because there is an option in the game where you can, not the game, the app, you can mention everyone by writing the at symbol and everyone, you can mention people. And you can suppress them, which is great, and good addition to, um, to the app. And there's also, you can also suppress at here, which is just saying everyone, mentioning everyone that's online. But, that's a great social media. And, sure you can disagree, but I don't. Um, this is my opinion. So, what I'm getting at here is, I know some good social medias, and I know some bad social medias. So in my opinion, bad social medias, to me, were Google Plus, and is um, Instagram, and Discord. And, you can have other opinions, but, that's your opinion. Because Instagram, they're adding stickers, tons of more stickers to their, um, stories, which is excellent. And, now they've got Instagram TV, which is basically YouTube slash Twitch of, um, Instagram. And now they've got, um, well, they just have live stories. And, so you can basically not have Instagram and um, YouTube, I mean, Insta YouTube and Twitch, I mean, and you've got this, and just go to Instagram, and you've got all the features that Snapchat has, except for Bitmojis, and YouTube has, except for a few other things probably, and what Twitch has, obviously without some certain things, and there you go, you got yourself a good social media and I sometimes I pit, I try to picture a mix between Discord and Instagram. That would be the perfect social media almost. As long as you have the basic post system that something like Facebook or Google Plus has, then it's a perfect social media. Custom emojis, video calls, group chats, everything. Just anything Discord has, anything Instagram has, any and that basic post system. Imagine posting a picture with a custom emoji. Posting a post. Or just you can create so many things. And I've got to say, Mino kind of has a lot of these things already. They have kind of they already have stickers tons and tons of stickers which are basically emojis that you post them separately and they can be animated for free and you can upload your own if you have the special um I mean the special Mino Plus I think I forget what it's called but um special version of Mino um so these are some great social medias and so yeah Wanna. So I just really, I just hope they bring Google Plus back. Anyway, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. You probably didn't because it's me just rambling on and on and on for about 15 minutes. If I can see my phone correctly and it'll probably be longer by the time I've ended it and posted on YouTube and blah 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 blah. Um, but yeah, just subscribe, like the video probably share it um if you want to join my discord server which i have completely 
revamping, not, well not completely, but I'm, I'm improving it as much as possible, trying to get the best user experience there is, while still having all the features I originally put into it. You can um, join by checking that page I told you guys about at the beginning of the video, where all my social medias are, because that's where it is. And I can talk really fast sometimes, kind of, yes. Probably should slow down a bit for videos, but then I probably wouldn't fit as much content in it, and yes, it's past 15 minutes now. It was wrong. 20 something seconds, I can't see what I mean from my eyes. Oh. Um, yeah, um, tell me in the comments below what you guys think I should ramble about on next, or ideas I should have. Um, gaming videos probably won't come back for a while. Um, I do have a game on my on the phone, um, Wrestling Revolution 3D, which I haven't tested the screen recording with it yet. This game I've, ha I've seen before, and I just thought I'd get it again. So I might um, play that, which is pretty funny. You know, it's just me dicking around, really. Like, for example, recently I was playing earlier, and I made this guy... Well, I made oh, was just this claustrophobic ring, and 20 people on top, and a ref well, no, 19 people on top, and just one referee, and I was just the one referee just dicking around doing my own things, because you can do that, you can't just switch to who you play as, so I became the referee, but everyone else is dicking around the tiny ring, the tiny little cage, and the giant ropes around it, and just punching each other up, and everyone's just getting injured all the time, left, right, and center. And while I'm dicking around, at the end of the match, Everyone else has literally shaved their hair because that was the conditions of the match. The losers shaved their hair. The winner, like the winner, good. Everyone else, I mean, a few other people broke bones and stuff, which I still made them fight because I'm a cruel dude now, apparently, in this game. Um, and it actually worked somehow, so. And I. Uh, what else did I do? Yeah, and the referee just, nope, not affected the law, just dicking around. Mostly just beating up random wrestlers. <laughs> oh my god, I love this game. Yeah, maybe I'll do a video on that at some point. But yeah, thank you guys for watching. How long's the video gone for now? Ah, 18 minutes almost. Well, see you guys in the next video. Bye. Quick side note, I did try to record this video much earlier, but I failed because of the... Uh, it was started pouring. If you didn't notice, it was kind of raining a bit, but not really raining. It was just the wind pushing a bunch of leaves up above, and the water was falling down. So this video will be over 19, will be over 18 minutes long because it's reaching the 18 limit now. Uh, well, on my phone it says it has, but yeah. Um, earlier it was pouring and. And since I'm outside here, all the way far away from the house, I kind of had to hide underneath these trees. Just hope I didn't get wet and pause the video. I had to, well, I didn't pause it, I stopped it. And I had to delete it so I could restart. And because there's no point in continuing on a failed video. This time the video was actually went successfully. And I thank the weather for letting me do this video. Which, I don't know why I'm th thanking the weather. It's been a dick to me. Fuck you, weather. But, yeah, if you saw me get surprised by horses, I thought it was someone who's gone for a walk, and I thought that's like, oh god, cursed to turn a video, Where, and that would ruin the video, but in fact, it was just a horse, so, glad that happened, so, yeah, this is going to be almost 20 minutes long, well, it's not going to be, because I'm going to end the video very soon, and I should stop rambling, so, yeah, um, as I said in the video multiple times, go find my social medias, and you can have contact with me all the time. Um, still need help with that game that I'm working on. Um, I am going to slow down a lot on it, and I will probably make an announcement on that. And, yeah, thanks guys for watching. Bye. No, this is seriously a goodbye.